All right, this is about four days after the wax. Left side is the turtle wax. I'm not even sure if you can see the left fender, but the left fender and then the left part of the hood where you see that line, that's turtle wax. The middle of the hood, this is all the Meguiar's liquid wax. And then the right hand side, uh, that's the auto finesse. Looks the same to me. Okay, uh, this is same time period, uh, about four or five days after the wax. Uh, the side that's closest to the camera right now, which will be the right side as I'm looking at it, but the left side as I'm facing the front of the car, uh, is the turtle wax. Turtle wax. Then right in the middle, if you will, if you see, the, if you can follow the two indentations on the hood. Uh, the middle pattern or the middle path is the Meguiar's liquid wax. And then the right hand side of the car uh, is the auto finesse. Uh, just from where I'm looking, I, I can't really tell the difference in the bead pattern. Uh, maybe a little bit more up here on this side closest to the camera from the auto finesse. If you look at the auto finesse side, it does look like there's a little bit more of a bead pattern. And then if you go up the middle. I don't know, I can't tell. Alright, we're two weeks after uh, the first application and I'm just showing you how it looks. Uh, I got a couple pictures of how it actually looks with rain on it and now I'm showing you how it looks with uh, the simulated massive flow of water. Again, the right side is auto finesse. The center of the hood and the rest of the car is Meguiar's uh, Gold Class Premium Liquid Wax and then the left side is the Turtle Wax Cleaner Wax Carnuba Plus. Okay, uh, it's been one month after I put the three waxes on. Again, just uh, for your, your essay, the left side is the turtle wax cleaner carnauba wax. The middle and the remainder of the, uh, well, the middle portion and everything else except for the front left and front right is Meguiar's liquid carnauba wax plus. And then the right side is auto finesse. That's the right side of the hood and the fender. Uh, this fender and just like the left side it's the left side of the hood and the, the left fender all right we're going to get it wet now so we can see uh, this is the right side again that's auto finesse not sure if you can see uh, the bead pattern still looks good good runoff the right side of the hood The center of the hood is Meguiar's and, the, and with the exception of the left side, the rest of it's Meguiar's. 
So this is the turtle wax. You can see the left fender. Uh, still a very good bead pattern in my opinion. Uh, you can see the beads. And then you see the runoff uh, as I spray across the hood. Uh, left side, the closest side to me is uh, turtle wax. Very good runoff. Okay, uh, this is after the wash, showing the runoff again, the right side, auto finesse. After the wash, you don't see a strict bead pattern. Same thing with the right side of the hood, but it's consistent through the rest of the car. Uh, you can't see any bead pattern for the most part with the water actually on it. And then the left side is turtle wax. And you see turtle wax still has a bead pattern. I'm not sure if you can see that, but you see turtle wax still has a bead pattern even with the sprayer on. Uh, you see Meguiar's. This is auto finesse. I don't see a bead pattern unless until I pull off. This is uh, Meguiar. Okay, uh, this is actually going to be the start, but it's really the end of a month-long uh, wax, if you will, time test. I compared three waxes, uh, Turtle Wax, Cleaner Carnuba Wax, uh, Auto Finesse's Spirit Line, and Meguiar's Liquid Gold, uh, Gold Class Carnuba Plus. And really, what I was trying to do is just compare waxes to see, uh, I made some assumptions like, hey, if the turtle wax is, I think it's like $10 out here, somewhere between $10 and, and $14. And then the Meguiar's wax was actually uh, about $21. And then the Auto Finesse was, it, it was originally priced at $70. I got it on sale for like $50. So I made some assumptions that, you know, the, the higher the, the, or the more the wax cost, the better it would perform over time. Uh, but I haven't seen that up to this point. Uh, so really it's four weeks, three waxes, two cars and 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 uh, two car washes I started this on uh, I guess about 1 August uh, it's actually 2 September now uh, I put the wax on on both of my cars this car that that you're looking at right now is actually of the current year this is a 2014 it's about we've had it for about a little more than three months I guess almost four months now yeah I think four months now and my other car is about five years old uh, so I did expect some differences, uh, but I didn't even see it on the other, on the older car. I've already cleaned that one. Uh, this is the last car right here. So uh, when I finish talking, I'm actually going to spray the hood of this car. Uh, and, and what I'm looking for is a bead pattern or the lack of bead pattern, if you will. I'm not a pro. I'm not a, a scientist or anything of that nature. So I look for the visible evidence to the normal person's eye, not to the the trained auto detailer, if you will. I'm looking for different bead patterns, different runoff patterns, uh, that sort of stuff. Uh, on this car, the, the entire car, with the exception of uh, the, the left panel, if you will, uh, this panel here and the left fender, that is uh, liquid turtle wax. Or I'm, I'm sorry, not liquid turtle wax. That is the turtle wax cleaner Carnuba Plus. And then the center of this car, uh, between, if you will, these two lines, the center of this car is actually the Meguiar's, uh, the Meguiar's Gold Class Carnival Plus Liquid Wax. The right side of the car, uh, following this vine, and the right fender, and the remainder of the car at that point, it's all uh, the Auto Finesse Spirit Line. So, I'm going to get started, uh, but again, I'm comparing three waxes over a month long uh, to see, you know, if I could see a visible difference after one month. Uh, for the month of August out here in South Korea, we had a, a pretty good monsoon season. It rained about every three days. I'd say every three days, and then there was a week or so uh, where we actually where we we received rain 
every day. So uh, at the end of July, I thought it'd be a great opportunity to test the wax out against the monsoon season uh, and just to see how they would actually come out. The monsoon season for the most part is over now. Again, it's September uh, out here. Okay, now we're moving on to the center. Again, this is the Meguiar's liquid wax. And then the left side. Turtle wax. Again, to me, I see the same sort of runoff pattern, whether I, I spray really hard or I missed it, for lack of a better word. I see the same sort of pattern on the left side that I do on the right hand side. I guess if you will, in this, this area here, maybe the bead pattern is a little bit tighter you know as you get down here when you compare it to this side you see you see the lack of visible uh, beads but here you, you you do see the mist you do see the bead pattern uh, still existent here I have I would be inclined to say is if you, as you go from left to right it does show a difference uh, but overall I'm not really sure if it shows a fifty dollar price difference uh, so, but it's, it's up to you. I'm not, I can't make the call. Uh, you can see the turtle wax. You can see the runoff over here on the left. It looks very much the same uh, to me uh, as the runoff over here on the right hand side. Uh, what I was expecting was something that was visibly and distinctively different uh, considering the prices, uh, the price differences of the waxes. Uh, at the, you'll see as I compile this video, I started uh, from the beginning to the end, so you're seeing the, the end results uh, first and then the, the starting results at the end. Uh, and I did say that I, I wasn't going to use the turtle wax anymore, but I'll tell you, I don't see that big of a difference. Uh, so to me, I, I would say the turtle wax is back on the table uh, just because I was expecting something, especially over time, I, I, I was expecting a, a noticeable degrade in performance on the cheaper wax. Uh, now maybe a month isn't long enough, maybe three months is, is a better test, but this is what I did at this point, uh, one month, and, and I can't really tell the difference. So. Okay, the car's been washed at this point. Uh, I'm just showing you the, you know, after, if you will, this is the last wash that I'm going to do so you can see how it, how it performs. You see at the top the bead, bead pattern. On the far left, my left, 